Now that breaking news out of Hartford. A student and a student teacher are in the hospital right now after part of a ceiling collapsed. It happened at the McDonough School in the Frog Hollow neighborhood. Channel 3's Matthew Campbell is on your side at the scene with all the newest details. Matthew? Well, Dennis and Denise, what's really remarkable here is the size. Officials describe it as being 6 by 10 by 12 feet. And you can imagine that is a very substantial portion of this ceiling. And you can imagine it just coming crashing down on unsuspecting students today. Papers were ripped down. Like, I saw a ceiling like it had a really huge hole. Destruction at the McDonough School in Hartford. In the middle of the school day, an eighth of the ceiling comes crashing down in the middle of the classroom. It's really noisy. Kids were screaming and stuff, but we got out quick. Talia Rodriguez was one of the approximately 20 students who were there to witness it all. In fact, she was in the same row where two of the injured were sitting. I thank God that I wasn't hit, but I still felt bad for the teacher. A student teacher and another seventh grader were hurt, suffering scratches and are expected to be okay. Talia says she was uneasy about this second floor room for months. The roof been broken since the beginning of the school year and we've been telling the teacher and the custodian found out. Those concerns seem to have fallen on deaf ears and parents are upset. I'm scared. I'm glad my child is fine, but you know, it's not it's not something you just not tell someone. Now the spokesperson for Hartford School says the inside of this school was renovated in the mid 90s and right now inspectors are going room by room determining if it is okay for students to return here tomorrow. That decision should be made by seven o'clock tonight. We are on your side here in Hartford. Matthew Campbell, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.